I was almost nine years old. And um, as I uh, said many, many times, having had terrible asthma, I had terrible asthma. My parents took me to the movies all the time. My father took me to see this film. He'd take me to see westerns and war films and musicals, but sometimes take me to the masterpieces. Uh, I don't know how, uh, you know, a guy who was uh, working in the garment district for 40 years uh, uh, picked up on the river, you know, to go see this thing. It, it turned out to be one of the most formative movie experiences. And I know I say that about a number of films, but this was something different and special particularly the use of color. There's no doubt about that. I would say um, this and The Red Shoes are the two most beautiful color films ever made. But I think something else happened when I saw that picture. It was the first exposure to a very foreign culture. I mean, I was exposed to Italian culture, of course, but with different Italian-Americans, Sic Sicilian-Americans, Sicilians, and having seen Italian neorealism on film. But this picture was different. It looked like no other movie I'd ever seen. It was the first color film to be shot in India, and it turns to be the first Technicolor film, first use of color by Renoir himself. I didn't know the name Renoir at the time. My family were not uh, educated, and uh, so I didn't know Renoir. But there, I was nine years old, and I was coming out of third grade, I think, in, in, uh, in um, parochial school, St. Patrick's Elementary School. And I remember vividly in third grade seeing paintings for the first time, little postcards. And uh, there was uh, symbolic paintings, and there was uh, Van Gogh's uh, Starry Night. And a couple of them were these beautiful little girls and women on a picnic uh, wearing beautiful dresses from the late 19th century France. Very, very rich and intense embracing of the subject matter by the painter. And I saw the name was Renoir. I don't know if I had made that connection when I saw the movie, but it was around the same time, you know. And then later I went to museums and actually saw his paintings, uh, the father's paintings. But I think the color in the film affected me strongly, and no doubt the nature of the culture that it was depicting, albeit through Western eyes. <laughs> 